12 different tunes, they all work, yes, aren't they? Yes, they work. Lovely, lovely. lovely. Uh, made at the turn of the century by Nicole Freire. Uh, and I'm surprised to see one or two English tunes on there. Yes, it's very interesting. And everything seemed for one working order. Yes. Lovely. Indeed. Right, at auction I would say 800 to 1,000 pounds. As much as that? Yes, and for insurance purposes, 1,200 pounds. I can see I have to raise my premium. Yes, a good it's idea. Good. Hello. Hello, sir. And what have you brought in for us? Well, I brought in a plate, yes. though it's rather damaged, and a pot. Right. I'll do with the plate first, I'm afraid because of the damage it's, uh, it's valueless. But um, you might find a museum in your locality which would be only too pleased to have this relic uh, due to the fine design. Oh, design. I see. Okay. So it's perhaps not totally worthless. No. Thank you. The pot is a different matter entirely, of course. Now this, um, looking at the shape, the coloration, and the fact that it is uh, unglazed would indicate to me that it is early Roman. Right. Right. Uh, how did you come by it? Well, it was an uncle of mine. He brought it back from Egypt in 1945 after the war. Yes. And um, it was left to me. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's been in the loft ever since because my wife didn't like it because it, there was a dead snake in the bottom of it. Really? <laughs> I take it it's not there now. No. No. no right. We're quite safe from snakes. Um, there is an inscription at the base. You see this there? Yeah. In Latin. Uh, the date would be what we know as 30 BC, which means this pot is over 2,000 years old. Really? Yes, and in excellent condition. Yeah. Also, there's um, an Egyptian hieroglyphic here. The symbol which would indicate um, this is the property of the Queen of that date, which, as we know, is Cleopatra. Really, yeah? Yes. Uh, which would tie in with the snake rather nicely. Uh, I would have to have these details checked by the Director of Roman Antiquities at the London Museum, but I have a very strong feeling about this pot. Uh, have you an idea of the value? No, none at all. We just thought it was an old pot. Yes. At auction, I would say you're looking at £200,000, at least. Yes. Uh, there would have been two of these made, because we do know that these particular objects were made in pairs. Right. Right. And um, <coughs> so if you had the pair, then I would say, <coughs> well, you could name your price. Mm. <coughs> right, thank you for that. I'd better take good care of this, I don't know. I should wrap it up in the <coughs> thing. Yeah, thanks thank very much. You're very welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.